Hey everybody, what's going on? Josh here with Scrapyard Films, and today I got another Vegas Pro 17 tutorial for you. In this episode, I'm going to be teaching you how to use the automatic slideshow tool. Now, this tool wasn't in any of the other versions of Vegas and is new to Vegas 17, and it makes creating slideshows extremely easy. Something they should have added a long time ago, in my opinion. But, without further ado, let's get to it. So once you have Vegas 17 loaded up right here, there's a couple things you could do. First off, I'm going to show you the importing function. So we go here and we go to insert, then we want to do slideshow and it brings up our slideshow creator. Now you can either press this file to add pictures or just click the big add pictures button. And once it loads up, navigate to the folder that you want. And I'm just going to show you a couple pictures from Ireland that we took. So I'm just going to select a few, you can hold control and click the ones you want to add in there. We can go there, 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 just add a few, just for effect. And then hit open, and it'll throw them all in here. Now inside this little menu, you can delete out of here if you wanted. You can rotate, you can sort and shuffle. You know, you can do a few little features in here. It's pretty cool. And if you go into the settings tab, then you can do a little bit more customization. And you can have the slideshow start at your cursor, start at a specific time on the timeline. You can tell it how long you want each picture to be, 3 seconds, 5 seconds, 10 seconds, whatever you want. You can even give it a total length that you want it to be, say you want it to be exactly 2 minutes, no matter how many pictures are in there. It will evenly make each picture exactly the length it needs to be to fit that 2 minute mark. So that's pretty cool. And then effects, it has some cool things you could do. Carousel, fades, film strips, you know, just a bunch of real cool stuff. Let's see what film strip looks like. Overlap, I want them to be three seconds. I want them to be two seconds. I want them to be one second overlaps. So let's see what that looks like. Great. Press play. Okay, gives us a little carousel look. That's not too bad. So let's do it again. So if we just do the cursor over here, we can choose a different effect. And let's just say maybe random with pan and zoom and then create. And it creates a new batch of it. Let's see what this looks like. Okay, so that looks pretty cool. Now there is a little bit of a you know an error there. I mean, who's gonna see all those pictures in a split second? You're only seeing it for one second. But yeah, you can adjust the time, the overlap, and all that, and that's perfectly fine. And so that's how you make a slideshow. Now you can get to this menu another way. If you actually right click on a video timeline, you can say insert slideshow and it'll bring you open to this window right here. So that is the entire tool. It's really cool, really useful for making collages really, really fast rather than doing it all manually. And I've made a couple slideshows in my day and that has been a big pain in the butt. This tool would have made it so much easier and I am glad it's in Vegas 17. So this is going to wrap it up for this video. If it helped you out, be sure to help me out. Maybe like, comment, subscribe. That'd be pretty cool. You know, I'm trying to hit a billion subscribers by the end of the year, and I think I can do it with your help. So thanks again for watching. I have a ton of videos about the Vegas 17 on my channel. If you wanted to go to Scrapyard Films and check that out, you know, I have a ton of tutorials that I'm creating for even old Vegas stuff and a bunch of other things. But that's going to wrap it up for this video, and I will see you guys in the next one.